What's up guys, welcome back to another week's episode. Feels good to be back, posting consistently. Um, today we're doing something a little bit different. I've actually never done this to any of my cars before, so it's going to be interesting. Um, if you've seen the previous video, you've seen that I actually don't have a sunroof on this car and that was one thing that I really, really wanted. Unfortunately, this car didn't have um, a sunroof, so today I'm going to wrap this Cape Town. Heading out there, um, going to wrap the roof and maybe even do the um, the mirror caps. But we'll see when we get there. The main thing is wrapping the roof, just to give that illusion of a panoramic uh, roof or a sun roof. Also, most of the RSs and Ss have it, so it will look fairly normal in a sense. Um, yeah. Like I said, I've never done it before, so we're gonna head out there now. I haven't cleaned the car. Like I said, it's been really bad weather and also bear with me with my voice. I have a bit of a cold because of the weather. But yeah, going to head out there now and then take it from there. I'm not sure exactly if I'm going to film or not. If I can leave the car there, how long they'll take. But we'll get all the details once we get there. now it took us a little longer because there was some traffic that we got caught in but yeah i don't know if i'm gonna drop the car or if i'm gonna wait while they do it i'll find out all that information in a bit so as you can see it looks really plain and not a fan of that so i think i'm going to do this whole section i also want to have a bit of this section done um, on the spoiler because that winglet that you saw that i bought spits very fine on you so um it's black keeping it black and I want to have this done black as well. This place is actually extremely cool. Um, I put some clips in of the whole setup of everything. It's really nice. They're just busy washing the car and then you pull it in and start up with prep. And then they'll start wrapping the roof. Hey guys, Vaughn here from Raptors Cape Town. Uh, we're just going to be doing a gloss black top on this on this Audi. Uh, so stay tuned and uh, let's see how we get it done. ended up leaving like halfway through the process so I'm not too sure what the complete uh, end result looks like I will find out shortly we're just on our way now to collect the car um, I'm actually quite excited to see how it turned out it is only the roof and the side mirror caps but I am contemplating or thinking like future to do the entire car what color do you guys think comment down below what color you think I should um, go I was thinking maybe like a satin color or do you think I should go something more outrageous or outstanding like a orange or yellow or something I don't know comment down below what you guys think but yeah once we get there I'll maybe have a chat with Vaughn to see if he has anything to say 
and let you know a little bit more about Raptors Cape Town and what they offer. So yeah, once we get there, we will reveal the car and see the end product. So I just arrived at home, I'm extremely happy with how the car turned out, I actually didn't film too much in there or get to interview uh, Vaughn, I was mainly speaking to him and his kid about the business and everything they recently just opened. So yeah, I'll leave all the details down below if you guys are interested in getting your car wrapped or anything, um, I'll leave all the details down below, you can check them out. Um, like I said, I am really impressed and happy with the outcome. The car, it's a little bit incomplete though because obviously I need to still do the rest of the things that I want to do to the car. So it doesn't really look too great. I wouldn't say it doesn't look too great in the sense that the workmanship was done well. But um, the car is incomplete. I still need to obviously lower the car to put the spoiler on, the lip on, the wheel on. Then it will look a bit more complete. But for now it looks little bit weird without those things but I am happy with the job and the outcome I don't know if it makes sense but maybe it just still has to grow on me and I have to get used to it but what I mean is you can see the car is obviously still high and it has um, the original wheels so once the car is dropped with a new set of wheels it should look good um, also the spoiler or the winglet I have to put on and it would all come together so we just have to trust the process but i'm extremely happy with the outcome it is a little bit dirty it was raining so you can see it's still a little bit dirty but it really looks good there is a bit of an orange peel to it but other than that it really looks good and the finish the lines is extremely straight even in here there's no vinyl that's like sticking out it's all very neatly done so this is a winglet that i showed you guys in the previous video that i bought a while back and that will fit on there and the reason why i wanted the entire thing black is because i'm keeping the winglet black so it'll basically fit on like that and look like a whole cohesive piece it won't be part gray and part black if that makes sense or silver not gray but this will fit in one of the upcoming episodes so stay tuned for that and then the only issue that i had is this is like a little tent over here that is very much visible but that was there before i had the car wrapped and um, there was a slight dent in the roof but i didn't repair that before we done the roof so it is a little bit visible but only at certain angles you pick it up other than that i'm um, extremely happy with the outcome looks really nice and actually the whole illusion thing actually worked my sister actually thought that i had a sunroof fitted so yeah i think that is it for this week's episode don't forget to like and subscribe and i will see you guys next week peace when my friends go 